guys welcome back to my channel my name is Cop Queen and today I want to start with a new project a design team project for Victoria design so let me first show you the papers I just pointed out so it's a, the brand new uh, collection pack it's a big pack and um, it's called library and uh, well I pointed it all out some double but the most of all uh, just one so let me just dig in real quick before I start this project um, so this is um, really f this is one of my favorite uh, pieces of this kit it really got loads of nice uh, elements and, and words that you can cut out I really love that and this pack includes a ton of nice cards in it and backgrounds I suppose I should have pointed this on the back but I forgot I pointed this all out but I can glue them down on the back so it gives the card a nice sturdy look then look at these tags and you also can print it out on the same background as this so I keep them together and this is oh this is pretty much the same but then with not this round in front of it look at this gorgeous I hope I can see you all but really I don't want to zoom it out because otherwise you it's too far but gosh I love this and it's a really a library team of course and just dig in this is the papers look one in color and one in sepia color amazing nice old tags nice backgrounds to use you see some I pointed out a double I think I want to use those more and these are just the journaling pages very easy to fold these in two look at this really awesome I have something in mind to do with it so I am anxious to start but I just wanted to show you first how everything is these are pretty much and look at this this is really my favorite ones I definitely going to use this as a font um, really amazing really with the gold elements wow I want to make these old books too love these old books and nice elements in it enjoy this book really carved really amazing and some in uh, just in black just in white and this is with color this is how it explains cutting out this one I thought that I, <laughs> I thought I printed it out myself too so it will be easy to follow what teeny mint with all these cut out love it and then yeah I printed out these two more times but this one was a little bigger so I cut off this edge but it's still useful but really love that and more tags to find more to come so all you see this is all you are gonna get in this big pack it's a bundle it's a library bundle and all that you see what I am going to show what I what yeah I show you right at this time <laughs> it's all in the pack so I believe there were were uh, 33 items in it so it's a lot so I put a link below if you are interested uh, in the same kit so but I really love this okay so yeah now it's time to start yay stay tuned and see what i'm going to do with it thanks for watching bye bye hey guys would you like to see what all these yummies are well stay tuned and i will show you wow it's amazing look how cool this is really oh excited well i'm gonna show you 
Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Scrap Queen and today I like to share with you my latest design team project for Victoria Designs. It's a printable web shop and um, I really enjoyed making this. This is a junk journal and I used so much lace in it. Oh my gosh, I really <laughs> overdo myself. But it was the very first time that I used my sewing machine on paper. And yeah, I went crazy. Well, I, normally I would... <laughs> I will do. For those who uh, like to see my tutorial, you will see uh, when I'm doing the project, it goes on and on and on and on. And well, at the end of it, I have four albums. Yes, I have. <laughs> it went crazy, but gosh, I love it. I really love the lace and everything in it. So I'm going to show you the first one. And, uh, well, the front, all my digital papers are from Victoria Designs. Um, beside of that, I did use some background papers. Well, the easy, but I will tell you in a minute. So, this is the front. I use a lot of lace on the top. And beneath here, some embellishment. Yes, again, I used this uh, decoration for the spine. I love it. I colored my own seam binding and that's also be seen in the tutorial so please watch that so let's open this up and it's just a lace ribbon for the closure and let's go inside this album has so much embellishments and <laughs> I really went crazy but I love it so let me introduce something uh, this is just a little tuck spot and this is a, a, a small pocket, just to decoration uh, on the front. Um, the entire album, I will flip really quick. I use some embellishments, some, some beads and charms on here. A glassine bag. And, oh, in this project I use the dies from Crealis. And... Ooh. I used this die and that is the CLBLT15 so you can watch that on her website that is www.crealis.nl CLBLT15 so you will see a lot of my tags using here in this album and also I use this die and that is the CLBLT16. So these two dies I used pretty much in this album. So you will see which uh, which one I used. So this was a little one. So okay. Um, oh, pretty much each page has um, some lace decoration. And it was the first time that I used my sewing machine. But I really love everything so i put also some uh, blank pages in otherwise it will be too much so that is why i choose um, some um, look at these wow it's amazing i really love the lace in it and the reason why i keep the other pages plain because i used so much embellishment and so much lace and these little tags are from Prima Marketing. I thought they will fit perfectly with the blue one. And this is also from Victoria Designs. You see me using uh, a lot of nice old images from nice ladies. And that is also from Victoria Designs. I'll put a link below the description box. Tuck spot, some lettering. And yeah, it goes on and on. You see me here. Again, a nice tag cutting out from the die. And in here there is a clean pocket, a clear pocket. Uh, use some embellishment and this was from Bo Bunny. I got from Donna. Thank you, Donna. I use so much things that I got um, from, um, from people. Let me tell you, really nice paper clip and i think this is a booklet and then a tag 
I use a sticker sheet. I use so many things. So these pockets are really nice because they are there is room for uh, plenty of nice things in it. So so is this. This is uh, cheese cheese clothes, something like that. Cheese cotton. I don't know what the name of it is, but I love it. Just a little journaling. Another die, some leftover pieces. You can put anything in here. It's amazing how many tuck spot this has, how many pages you can write on, so many little tags in. There's no friend as loyal as a book, really. That's so special. I love books. I love making books. And this is a tuck spot where you also have a letter uh, behind. I use some burlap pockets, also from Donna. Thank you, Donna. I use so much. I love it. I love, 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 love it. Another pocket. And this one is also, this is not from Victoria Designs. That's actually wrapping paper I got somewhere. And um, put some beads on. Really love that. And uh, so yeah, this goes on and on. This is a brown, um, a brown pocket. And behind there is a leather where you can write on. And in the front also some tuck spot and in here um, a glassine envelope with something in it. It goes just on and on and on and on. <laughs> and I love it. It's so cool. That is the reason I, I used so much embellishments and even thick buttons and I did not care anything about the thickness. I just went go on and on and on and on um, till I have um, four signatures. This is also a clear, a clear pocket. Um, till I have four uh, signatures. And, oh, something went off here. And um, and and those four signatures was actually uh, the meaning uh, for um, for one book. Well, you can imagine if this is one signature. <laughs> How that book will look like so that is not uh, what I was ending up so I thought well let's make four books because it was really too thick and I will not waste all the work that I put in it so let's go to the second one okay the next one is this one and I really go really quick so this is the front I love these images cool oh, Tear them out, use some burlap for the back, uh, put some lace on the front, a blue rose. This is also from Victoria. I really love, really cool. And I even uh, in the tutorial, you will see how I colored my seam binding so everything is being seen. So, really quick, go through it. It's pretty much each one is, is pretty much the same. This one is also a clear, uh, a clear pocket. And on the back, the nice tag I used. And you will see <laughs> so much embellishment. I just love it. Oh yeah, this is just a little thing. So you can turn this open. And uh, this is some vellum. I printed out some vellum. And another... There is so much to see. So much in each album. There is so much... You can write in, you can tuck spot, another charm embellishment. Look at this, an envelope with lots of things in it. I will not go everything. But I love it. It's so cool. Really, another glassine bag. So yeah, loads of stuff in it. Paper clips, embellishments. That is just amazing. Again, um, a pocket with a nice paper clip. Uh, another pocket. Pocket, pocket, pocket. Loads of things. And even the stickers I like. Look at that. Little thing here. It, it's really a journey to flip to all these pages and see what's all inside. There is so much. Even here I made a little tuck spot right here. And I used a book, a Dutch old book. Also making pockets, clear pages, really simple pages. 
Oh, and these are, oh, these are really fun, just making notes, notes, notebooks, again, a nice charm, a little envelope I made with my envelope punch, and this goes on and on, a bit, well, this you can flip open, and here we are at the end, alright, so, let's, this together with a bow okay up to the next one there's still two to go <laughs> oh I love it okay next front uh, I used again a nice image a nice big button on the front I put on every uh, album this beat with made with love on it I don't know if you can see that but I love that other blue, there are four different colors of blue on the side for the seam binding, so it was a really challenge for me. Okay, next one. Really, it's all been the same. I really go quick, quick go to another um, journaling, beads, pockets, beads, charms, burlap pockets, and to all, yeah, all the tags. Everything is from Victoria Designs. Perhaps uh, this one. This one is from Prima Marketing. Uh, just a tuck spot here. Just a belly band here. Another little tuck spot from Lace. Lace we got so much. <laughs> like I said, it was my very first time and I really like doing that. A clear pocket with the tuck spot behind. A belly band. Another bead and charms and pockets 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 and another pointed vellum tuck spot here clear pocket here with a tuck spot behind really love these images these uh, um, I call these these paper clips really they are amazing Love these. Where did they go? Um, so yeah, it went on and on and on. Big pocket. Oh, and uh, this one you can tuck something behind it. Another bead. Bead embellishments. Another um, paper clip. Gosh, I use so much. And this is really a nice opportunity to use all your... Uh, this is another um, little pocket with some notes in it. These are all little notes. Use it all. But I was trying to say... Um, this is really a, a perfect way to use all your embellishments. I really went quick. You will not see <laughs> how my desk looked when I when I did this. I put my hot glue on and I used other glue, of course. But it's it's amazing. It's so much fun. So much fun. Use all your uh, stickers and, and, and ribbons and, and bows. Just... Place it all at your table and just go with the flow. Another glazing bag, tuck spot here, butterfly, flowers. It just went on and on and on and on and on and on. I love it. I love, love, love it. Okay, so look at this big bead. So you can tie this. And put the big bead on outside. And then one more to go. Wait, I think I will leave this right here. Otherwise it will fall down, I think. Um, yeah, this one. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love this frame. It's from uh, Tim Holtz. I got it from Julie, thank you. And uh, another color blue on the side. I use also some uh, music backgrounds from Victoria Designs. Yeah, and of course inside of here it's pretty much the same, but I will let you see it. So this is um, a tuck spot here and inside you can 
put also some things in it and behind also some things a big lace um, pocket and again some notes and these are elastic so you can put loads of things in it and um, another tuck spot look at this that's really I think this is a cameo cameo don't know a tuck spot on top here a leather on the back tuck spot here a little envelope vellum printed out another lace pocket journaling background um, envelope um, some paper clips another bead this goes on and on and on I just love it what do you think I went crazy didn't I yes I did I really went crazy <laughs> and I loved every page really I uh, I I can't say that enough um, I don't know Shall I be addicted to it? Yeah, I, I don't think that this will be the last one because I love it, really. If you have so much embellishment and, and really with my new storage system with all the little uh, drawer, drawers, it, it's amazing. You can pull everything out right, right in front of you and that's, that's just awesome. Alright, I really love these tags, these dies from Creolise. They are really awesome. Another... Um, journaling juke, juke um, thing going on oh this my bead was in, the, in behind oh and look at this lace is that, that's amazing really so cool a doily oh yeah this is a, a special belly band with a nice uh, doily and this goes on and on and on and when I started the project, well, um, it's for the library kit, and I will tell you and let you see. This is also a, um, a clear pocket and a pocket behind, oh, of course. And um, it's a library kit, and it's a really large um, package you get. And um, don't forget the 10% code, the 10% discount code then you get 10% discount of every purchase on um, oh this is also a clear pocket nice for a photo and a large pocket on the back so um, what I was trying to say I use the library kit and it's um, a very large kit and in my tutorial you will get to see everything I used uh, from the library kit and um, if you like to use the same papers I did then don't forget uh, to use my coupon code <laughs> then you get a 10% uh, discount and if you use the word scrap queen then you get the 10% of the entire website so uh, please use that uh, then you help me a little and uh, you help yourself of course too with that um, so what do you think <laughs> it's it yeah it, it's overwhelming I know it's amazing I really love how everything is um, especially when you see these all together <laughs> when you all see these okay let me try these okay wow isn't this just gorgeous I really like the blue and that was was special um, I really like the papers but the papers of course library are blue uh, brown but I thought it needed uh, I it, it, it needs a color but I will tell you all in my tutorials really I have a very long tutorial and I hope you like it I hope I did uh, I did show you everything in the tutorial how I made these um, I think I did um, so give me a thumbs up if you like this <laughs> I know I do and please subscribe to my channel if you don't already are I really appreciate that I really appreciate every comment or question you leave below this video I will try to answer them right away or at least soon enough 
and um, yeah so don't forget victoria designs use the 10 percent discount code scrap queen i will put that below the description box also all the links i used for the for the for the papers all right well stop brabbling <laughs> thanks for watching bye bye